guys, today I'm going to do a DIY version of a hair and Preston hoodie. So the other day I was swiping through Instagram stories and I saw Eliza Koshy's and she was wearing this hair and Preston hoodie with a heron on it and I really love herons and so I saw that hoodie and I was like, oh my gosh, I love this and I thought I could make a DIY version of it. I looked up Heron Preston online and they're a bigger designer, kind of expensive stuff for my kind of budget. So I thought I could do a DIY version of it. Um, so I went out and I found just a simple black hoodie at Kohl's, it was on the clearance rack. And I thought I could try to do a Heron painting on the front. <laughs> so I went to Walmart and I found this like fabric spray paint, it's Tulip Color Shot Instant Fabric Color. And I thought I could use it as like a base layer on the black hoodie to kind of help the colors show up. Um, I think I'm going to do like acrylic paints on top of it. So before I actually use the spray paint, I'm going to tape off the rectangular area where I want the paint to go so it doesn't go all over the place. So I have some masking tape and some newspaper and I'm going to go ahead and tape off the sweatshirt. And one other thing I forgot to mention is that you want to protect the inside of the fabric and like the other side of the sweatshirt so the paint doesn't soak through. So I'm going to put just a piece of cardboard um, inside of the sweatshirt to protect the back. Or you could use like more newspaper. But I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so now I think I'm ready to do the spray paint. And Again, this is a fabric spray paint, so it's washable after a certain amount of time, and it dries pretty quickly. Here we go. Um, it says to do thin coats. Um, you can do multiple coats at a time, but you don't want to build them up too thick at first. So, Let's see how this works. <laughs> There's one coat. I'm going to turn on a fan now. <laughs> okay, so it's been about seven minutes and the bottle says that you can wait like five minutes between coats. So I'm going to go ahead and do another layer. And this time I'm going to spray in the opposite direction of how I have been spraying. So it gives it a more even coat instead of being kind of streaky. So here we go, coat number three. Okay, I think I'm going to do one more layer, I'm um, supposed to be layer number four. Okay, so it's been a little over two hours and this is pretty much dry and I'm pretty happy with how thick the paint is on here, so I'm going to go ahead and start doing the um, hair and painting. Okay, so now I have all my painting supplies set up. I have my tray um, to put the paint in, all my acrylic paints, water. Uh, a rag to dry off my brush, and then I have a bunch of different brushes. So the first thing I'm going to do is start by adding in the heron, um, just kind of laying out where I want that shape to go. And I think I'm just going to do one heron, I think the original um, sweatshirt had two, but I'm just going to put one to kind of keep it from being too busy. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and lay out where I want the heron to go. So now I have the basic placement of the heron in. I'm gonna add a lily pad down here, I think, and then just some of the marsh grasses around and the water, and I think I'm just gonna go for it. So I'll let you know how it turns out.
So I stayed up last night and finished painting this and I absolutely love how it turned out. So I can't wait to show you guys. So I absolutely love how this turned out. I love the colors. I think the one heron worked out really well. Um, the only weird thing is that the design is a little bit off-centered, but that's okay. I'll just stand crooked or something, but I really, really love how this turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was a really fun video for me to make, so let me know below if you enjoyed the DIY projects and maybe I can do some more videos like this in the future. Be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!